So, yeah, good to see you. Yeah. It has been good to see you a too. while. It's, it's it has been a been while. Too long. It's been, uh, yeah, yeah. Quite a, maybe a couple months. Too long. In a couple in a, yes. In, 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 a, in many ways for my, for my need for Dharma dialogue. <laughs> <laughs> which is, Sorry about which is that. great. No, <laughs> yeah, I was so busy with the move back to California. Believe yes, me, uh, indeed. well, you know, of course, but international moving is not exactly the most. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm amazed you were able to do it that quickly. Actually, you know, within a, just a couple of yeah. months. Yeah. So, well, my stuff is on a boat somewhere, so it'll oh, be coming so, along in okay. a couple of months. <laughs> Speaking of boats, do you like my? Uh... My yes, creation there, nice. my background. I created this on Night Cafe Studio, in collaboration with the AI, a kind of yes. cosmic ship of the vow, uh, mm -hmm. kind of thing. Anyway, but uh, yeah, so it's good to see or, you. Uh, Very yeah. good to see you. All right, so yeah, yeah. good to see you too. Um, well, so I guess I'll share something new that I that came up. Sure. Um, which is that uh, since moving back to California, uh, I'm, I'm uh, planning on uh, to attend a certain uh, service at uh, Guadalupe Buddhist Church, which is, which is about a maybe 15 minute drive from where I live. Um, so the great thing about that is I'll have a chance to uh, get involved with the community there and also um, keep up my uh, practicing of chanting Shoshinge and Wasan, which I do want to continue to do until I finally get to Tokudo. Yeah, so, uh, definitely. So that's I'm kind fresh. of looking forward to that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. Um, so uh, what else? I think um, something I was kind of excited about is um, Higashi Honganji, uh, Otani Ha, just or is shortly releasing the second edition of their Shinshu State, which is pretty cool, actually, because it'll then be the, the sort of the newest edition of, of uh, the Shinshu scriptures available, because ours is already uh, like 20 years old at this point, even though it's the, wow. the second edition. So I'm actually kind of looking forward to getting my hands on a copy. It's actually got some very nice features that ours okay. doesn't have. Cool. By ours, I mean the Nishi Nishi Hongji. Yeah. 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 Um, including the, for example, the three sutras have the uh, kanbu, the original Chinese characters, on the half half of the page, and then the the other half is the Japanese uh, reading. So. It's very great. It's really good for referencing the original uh, text of the, the sutra. Oh, and they excellent. also put that in Kyogyo Shinsho, where it's called the um, Goji Shaku, which is Shinran Shonin's own interpretations of the uh, the passages. Um, as you know, you know, the, the, the most of Kyogyo Shinsho is uh, you know, quotations from different masters and the sutras. And then occasionally Shinran will put in his own interpretation, his own, and that's called the Goji Shaku. So in this particular edition of the Shinshu Satan, the, uh, the Goji Shaku is actually also printed below in the Kanbu. So you can actually reference what characters Shinran chose to express, you know, his, his, uh, uh, interpretation. So it's a very nice wow. edition, and uh, yeah. it has essentially the same text that the Nishi Satan was. But uh, kind of looking forward to getting my hands on on one when it gets printed on uh, the first of yeah, April. definitely. Sounds good. Sounds exciting. So what is what is new on on your side of the Atlantic? <laughs> uh, <laughs> um. You mean just in in general, or do you mean just uh, with oh well my Jodo way, Shinshu yeah, path, of, or yeah, your maybe your your, your journey on the, yeah, sorry, the Shinshu okay, path. Just, yeah. I, either one is fine. Lots well, going on in life, I guess, but yeah, as far as yeah, as far as my 
my journey, I'm, uh, my Jodo Shinshu journey, I definitely uh, want to, I'm very much glad to be getting back to Dharma Dialogue with you. <laughs> um, although um, mm. I've been continuing my, you know, Dharma Dialogue with my Dharma brothers on Tuesdays. Um, mm -hmm. But it's a kind of very different, that's more of a three-way discussion and it's it's more, it's a different, it's it's different. Um and sometimes we, you know, we, 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 you know, we're, we're reading, well, all the, all the time we read, we, we have selected past, you know, pa passages that we read from, um, mm -hmm. and then we kind of discuss, you know, yeah. line by line or paragraph by paragraph or whatever, but often, and sometimes it'll stay in that form, but often it becomes more free form discussion, which is great, you know, so we kind of yeah. go, we kind of do both. We, we, ones where we, you know, we, 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 we kind of stick with, you know, really commenting and discussing or or reflecting on mm -hmm. what we've read. Uh, but also we do kind of, like I said, this more free form discussion. We'll get on a tangent and from that related to the subject, but it takes us in a whole nother, yeah. you know, into a whole nother discussion, which is which is great. And and that's great. It's literally like to have that once a week you know, is, is fantastic. Cause you just, you're having mm -hmm. a conversation you just would never have <laughs> almost ever exactly you know, yeah. with anyone yeah, else yeah. In, in the week and in the month. So, yeah. um, so yeah, I've been, been, and I've been leaning into them, uh, a lot with, you know, I've let them know about my own, they, they're aware of my own difficulties with hitting the wall as it were and the, and the doubts and, uh, you know, barriers and questions I have, uh, the core, I'm talking about the core ones, not, you know, mm -hmm. that's, that's what we're down. I feel like that's kind of what we're down to now. We're down to the, you know, we're down to the, to the rub now it's, it's, you know, we're down to the I'll rubber, hit, the rubber, the rubber's hitting the road now. It's, you know, <laughs> and you know, it's the, yeah. Yeah, the the core core doubt. So, uh, so I'm just, I'm just really glad to be getting back to these, these discussions yeah. um i have ideas for this you know today if we wanted to that you mm -hmm. know for, for a discussion um because i did start my reading of of um the collected works of oh great Shinran, as yeah. you know. how, how is that going <laughs> going good going good but i i and i we've talked about this this the subject that i want to cover uh yeah before um well there's two there's one from the preface that i want to kind of have uh -huh. a discussion of and that's yeah. to involve all of the references of you know it, this is the the path this is the all available universal path mm -hmm. for us ordinary mm -hmm. beings and yet about six or seven or whatever many different ways he says and that's in those same paragraphs in the preface this is the hardest thing <laughs> It's hard to encounter, hard to, hard to, to <laughs> accept, hard to, yeah. Do you see what I mean? Yeah. So I want to talk about that. So, but then the, and then in the first, you know, uh, the, the, the section on uh, teaching, the teaching, I think it is, mm -hmm. uh, where it talks about, and it had to be in the first, you know, chapter is where I got mm -hmm. really stuck, you know, okay. on why. I mean, I kept reading, but I got really, I, I, and I've always been stuck on the question of, from from chapter one, why the the auspicious signs of this particular sutra indicate mm. Shakyamuni's whole reason for coming to, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, for, for, sorry, indicate you know why Shakyamuni, the whole purpose of Shakyamuni, yeah. um. Uh, manifesting as Shakyamuni Buddha, you know, was to deliver the, you know, the Pure Land Sutras, was to deliver the Pure Land teaching, was to live, you know, to deliver the, right. you know, the, the, non, the knowledge of, yeah. of Amida Buddha and that, you know, that the, the uh, other power, thou, you know, Amida's vow, Dharma gate, mm -hmm. you know, um, but, mm -hmm. but, you know, why these auspicious signs when there's surely, other in other sutras very auspicious signs that start the sutra yeah. but like for right. example the the lotus sutra you know is pretty mind-blowing <laughs> this yeah. the auspicious and, signs and of is like multi <laughs> multi-dimensional yeah. yeah. outside of time and space 
you know, multi-dimensional worlds intersecting. Do you know what I mean? And in this time, you know, in the meeting, the assembly up in the in the sky, mm -hmm. and do you know what I mean? So mm -hmm. that's so it's just kind of like why these this that that this was the whole reason yeah. it came and not these other. Mm -hmm sutras that have a do you see mm -hmm. what i mean and what how yes. from that text what in that text points that out specifically yeah, yeah? and it's kind of like the yeah. first you know the first part that introduces all that yep i'm on board yep everything that's saying yeah i get that's and then the last mm -hmm. like couple, few paragraphs yes i'm bored but everything in between i'm like what what how is that yeah so what do you think? Do you think that's coverable tonight? Um, yeah, we can. Well, we can certainly give it our best shot and maybe right. uh, at least start discussing. Do you want to start it, with right? the preface part? The one, the questions yeah, yeah. I had about the preface yeah, well, then. Let's, let's so, go with that. All right. Shall I share my screen? I've got it up already. I've got the. Oh, oh perfect. First of all, should we do some Nembutsu first? Um, oh, certainly. Certainly. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I'm I've got my phone, so I can't okay. not yeah. show properly. That's all right. Namo Nidabutsu. Namo Yeah. All right. So let me share my screen. There all right. The preface or Sojo is yes. called in Japanese. <clears throat> kind of um, blew me away when I first read it, even though yes. I didn't fully understand <laughs> the, uh, all the implications all of, of it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <clears throat> all right. So, shall we? Can you see it? Okay, on your phone. Do you, do you yes, want me to, it's you want me to Yeah. Make it bigger or no? Is that fine? Is that good? Yeah. Um. Yeah, bigger? it should be fine. Bigger. I think so. Oh, it's at one fifty now. So. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right, so the major expositions, the true teaching, practice, and realization of the Pure Land Way preface. So first of all, we should probably say, just in case so people know, this is basic. This is the beginning of, jo of Kyogyo Shinjo. Um, yes. You know, Shinran Shonen's, you know, opus, mm -hmm. I guess you would say, the the, the magnum opus. The, the magnum opus, yeah. <laughs> anyway. Great work, yeah. <laughs> All right. So, the true teaching, practice, and realization of the Pure Land Way preface. Uh, I reflect within myself the universal vow, difficult to fathom, is indeed a great vessel bearing us across the ocean, difficult to cross. The unhindered light is the sun of wisdom, dispersing the darkness of ignorance. Thus, it is that when the conditions for teaching, for the teaching of birth in the Pure Land had matured, Devadatta provoked Ajatasatru to commit grave crimes. And when the opportunity arose for explaining the pure act by which birth is settled, Shakyamuni led Vaidehi to select the land of peace. In their selfless love, these incarnated ones, Devadatta, Ajatasatru, Vaidehi, all inspired, all, uh, all aspired to save the multitudes of beings from pain and affliction. And in his compassion, Shakyamuni, the great hero, sought indeed to bless those committing the, gra the five grave offenses, those slandering the Dharma, and those lacking the seed of Buddhahood. We know, therefore, that the auspicious name embodying the perfectly fulfilled supreme virtues is true wisdom that transforms our evil into virtue, and that the diamond-like Shinjin, so difficult to accept, is true reality that sweeps away doubt and brings us to attainment of enlightenment. Shall we start with that paragraph? There's enough there actually for really? an entire <laughs> for an entire Indeed. session. A couple of sessions. Yes. I mean, we've kind of talked about some of it when we discussed the my experiences while going through the, uh -huh. the contemplation sutra and, you know, and discussing the 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 sort of uh, this the this the drama the drama unfolding before that was happening you know, well, since in some cases, long before the the uh, contemplation sutra was mm. delivered, but up to that point, 
you know, as well, more in more recent events <laughs> of the, uh, you know, that set the stage, as it were, for the uh, Contemplation Sutra. Mm -hmm. um, but so is there, um, so the, the thing I want to discuss, so it says, you know, this is the great vessel bearing us across the ocean, difficult to cross. So there's the first, you know, first, yeah. right, first, first sentence. Difficult, yeah. difficult to cross. But that, of course, that is referring to the self power, right. you know, of our own self power. It's difficult to cross. Yeah, um, it's you know, it's. Uh, I think in the. Um, I kind of want to look at the what the Japanese says, but uh, and also notice, I think um, <clears throat> difficult is actually twice in this. Uh, this particular passage. Yeah, yeah, so the, yeah. This first paragraph, it's twice. You get two different difficult in the beginning and difficult at the end. <laughs> yes, <laughs> is, that, is that what you're referring to? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, basically, you know, um, first of all, the vow that's difficult to fathom, and this is um, non gino guse in Japanese. So literally, you know, difficult to to comprehend, essentially. And then, of course, the ocean of, of birth and death of, of uh, existence is, is difficult to cross. Um, and so this kind of reminds me of in the hymn by Nagarjuna, where he says he ferries uh, himself across, he crosses the ocean of birth and death and then ferries others across, speaking of the Uri Tatagala. Say who what were you referencing now? Who who, who were you referring to there? Um, Sorry. I believe in, in Nagarjuna's hymn. Nagarjuna. Okay. Uh, Nagarjuna. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so it's I mean the, you know the the difficulty you know, that the first difficulty is not just self-power, but I, I suppose it's the difficulty of, of for ordinary, you know, mm. ordinary foolish spiritual idiot beings like ourselves. Yeah. First of all, just trying to, just comprehending the ocean, you know, of, right. of Sam, you know, of Samsara difficult to cross to get to the, you know, other side. Um mm -hmm. Well, and also we tend anyway. to, I think, you know, because we're used to the story, but that what a what an incredible feat Shakyamuni accomplished <laughs> is, I think, something that we always have to be reminding ourselves of. Yes, you know, and that's kind of what uh, I think too is is uh, being uh, sort of pointed to, also to speak here. Yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah, well, it's, uh, go ahead, yeah. Well, and also, you know, we're reminded of the, the twofold analogies that Shakyamuni used to, to uh, sort of explain the, the rarity or the difficulty, as Shinran puts it here, of, of encountering the Dharma, right? So the first is we have to be born as a human being. And, uh, Yep. And Shakyamuni said the light, you know, the the um the rareness, so to speak, of being born as a human is as if there was a turtle in in the great sea that surrounds, you know, the, the world. And then there was a, a small little ring of wood. And then once every, I think so so many thousands of years, this turtle comes up and pokes its head up above the, the water for a breath of air. And the likelihood, according to Shakyamuni, of us being born as a human being in the first place is the likeliness of that turtle sticking its head through that little ring of wood floating on the surface. Yeah. <laughs> and if you think about it, even not if you think about all the causes and conditions that have to come together in order to, to, to make your life, my individual existence, you know, Exactly. It's it's really quite mind boggling. Yeah. Exactly. Um, and, and in fact, I think that's one of the difficulties that Shinran mentions in this 
in the preface, that's one of the, it was the human birth, I think, if I'm not mistaken. I might be mistaken, but I thought there yeah. was there was a mention of that. But anyway, yeah. It, so that's yeah, that's one of the one yeah. of the many. It, so it's just it's part part of it is there's this it's this juxtaposition of this is the this is the the ultimate. This is this is the ultimate Buddhism. This is the ultimate teaching. This is the universal teaching. This is the light that reaches. There's nowhere that the light doesn't reach. You know, mm. this light doesn't reach. Mm -hmm. There's nowhere that that the name can't be heard. There's, mm -hmm. you know what I mean. Um, mm -hmm. And yet, <laughs> there so are all these difficult. To yeah, so difficult <laughs> to accept. Yeah, so the first thing here is, you know, uh, yeah, so we know for therefore the auspicious name embodying the perfectly fulfilled supreme virtues is true wisdom that transforms evil uh, evil into virtue and that the Diamond Line Shin, Shinjin, so difficult to accept, is true reality that sweeps away doubt and brings mm -hmm. us to attainment of enlightenment. Yes, and how difficult it is. Let's just appreciate the honesty with which Shinron is, is <laughs> addressing many, us here. The first you know, paragraph. I mean, that's... How, many, how many how many teachers tell you, oh, the path is so easy. It's you know <laughs> simple to have faith and believe. Just just follow what I say. You know. But Shinron just lays it out, you know. <laughs> <laughs> this is hard. <laughs> Exactly. I love it. Exactly. That's what I love about Chinron though is he's honest. He doesn't he doesn't pull any any punches, you know. No. No. And it's that's like... what our ego needs sometimes is to not to, to be knocked and do yeah. <laughs> knocked exactly. away. First, I'm gonna show you the wall first. Yeah. That's the first yeah. thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you the wall first. And then right. yeah. Um in yeah, any one of these passages, I, I love Zikian Sensei, and I used to say that, like, sometimes for, for the realization of Xinjiang, you know, a single sentence, a single passage is really all you need. And just just keep, like, kind yeah. of like a koan, yeah. you know, just, just keep that passage and work with it and, and let it work on you. And then see what happens. This is basically what he would he used to say. And I, I think it's true. Like Xinjiang so difficult to accept. But that right there, literally, if you if you plumb the depths of that, that those yeah. simple words, yeah. if you plumb the depths of that, you'll find Xinjiang at the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, but this is the thing too. It's the juxtaposition. It's like it's almost yeah. like it's like the you know the juxtaposition of samsara nirvana you know that they're mm -hmm. two two sides of a you know coin or you know they're just they're the same they're one and the same and there's yeah. you know one you know one and we're here we are in samsaric existence in all mm -hmm. our ignorance just so the complexity is is unfathomable un, you know unfathomable how we are kept you know here in this ignorance and in this do you know what i mean um i mean we have teachings in buddhism that explain how that happens but you know to be able to really conceive of it you know that's a whole nother you know and um and we're so so close and yet so far you know we're we are of buddha nature but we have no clue that we are mm -hmm. we have no mm -hmm. clue we have we just yeah. and and so it's like here so this whole last sentence we know, therefore, that the auspicious name embodying the perfectly fulfilled supreme virtues is true wisdom that transforms evil, our evil into virtue, and that the diamond-like children. So di it's like there's it's the this it's the most powerful thing in the multiverse. It's the in all multiverses. It, it, every it's the ultimate thing. And yet, so mm. you know. And that diamond-like Shinjin, so difficult to accept, is true reality. Yeah. That's Swiss way. And do you see what I mean? There's notice, that. It's yeah, like yeah. anyway. Well, and I think too here, you know, this is Gyo and Shin, right? So 
practice and Shinjin. And Shinran always always has, you know, always sort of ties Shinjin to the working of the, the auspicious name embodying the perfectly fulfilled virtues, as he says here, you know. And these these virtues are not a static kind of thing that you collect. The virtue here is really kind of the the dynamic working of Dharma, right? So, uh, which is true wisdom that that transforms our evil. Yeah, this one sentence, you know, is like everything <laughs> is all here. You know? <laughs> exactly. exactly. Uh, it's, uh, I wow. think we've referenced that before. Wow. Uh, this this last sentence of this paragraph. It's just uh, that alone. That could be a whole, you could probably do a whole series of discussions on that. Shall we continue? Yes, continue? but let's continue for now. Yes, let's do that. So this then is the true teaching. Easy. So here we go. This then is the true teaching. Easy to practice for small foolish beings. It is the straight way <laughs> easy to traverse for the dull and ignorant. So, all right, yeah. cool, cool. Easy to practice, straight easy way, to easy to traverse. Dull and ignorant, yeah. yep, that's me. Foolish beings, yep, that's me. Small foolish being, yeah, that's me. Dull and ignorant, yeah, that's me. Okay, good. E easy to practice, you know, easy to traverse. Yeah. All right, cool. Among all teachings uh, the great sage preached in his lifetime, none surpasses this ocean of virtues. Let the one who seeks to abandon, so we got the ocean of virtues behind us. We're rocking mm -hmm. and rolling. We are sailing, baby. Let the one who <laughs> seeks to abandon the defiled and aspire, uh, let the one who seeks to abandon the defiled and aspire for the pure, who is confused in practice and vacillating in faith, whose mind is dark and whose understanding deficient, whose evils are heavy and whose karmic obstructions manifold. I, this part, I always feel like, you know, the, um, you know, the, um, uh, the scene in Groundhog Day. Yeah. And he, he at some point in the repetition of the day, he she she he has he has uh, what's her name? Andy McDowell list, you know, his Andy McDowell's character list all the things that she finds, you know, wants to have in the, you know, the perfect kind of man, the perfect mate. Yeah. And, and she's listing them all. And he's like, me, 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 me. I, I'm so close here. <laughs> It's like a description of you, right? <laughs> yeah. So when I was when I when I'm reading through that, that I I think of that moment, me, me, yes, me. Yeah. Anyway, so all right, exactly. <laughs> so let such, especially the well, anyway, let such persons embrace above all the Tathagata's exhortations. Take refuge without fail in the most excellent direct path. Devote themselves solely to this practice and revere only this Shinjin. Mm. So there's a whole lot in that mm -hmm. last bit. But essentially, the, the pith of this paragraph is that it's easy to practice and easy to traverse yes. for easy. people like us. Yeah. And 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 it, and it goes on to, and you know, yeah. you know, if you are you are you a you know s small foolish being, dull and ignorant, you you know you seek to abandon the defile, aspire for the pure. You are you are you confused in practice, vacillating in faith. You know, so you're you're hooked in. You're yep yep that's yep that's me. And then the next paragraph. <laughs> ah, hard to encounter even in many lifetimes, is the decisive cause of birth, Amida's universal vow. Hard to realize, even in myriads of kalpas, is pure Shinjin that is true and real. If you should come to real... So, yeah. So after that whole paragraph, easy to practice, mm -hmm. easy to traverse. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's me. I see myself in, those, in everything it's saying. This is it. This mm -hmm. is the way... Ugh. Yeah. Hard to encounter, hard to realize. Oh, we've got ten minutes. I'm getting the I'm getting the ten minute warning. By the way, okay. So anyway, um, yeah. So should I just uh, read the next bit? 
Um, sure. Yeah. yeah. What, if, what if we finish this paragraph and then we'll okay. discuss it? If, yeah, exactly like we did the other. If you should come to realize this practice and Shinjin, rejoice at the conditions from the distant past that have brought it about. Uh, but if in this lifetime still you are entangled in a net of doubt, then unavoidably you must pass once more in the stream of birth and death through myriads of kalpas. Wholly sincere indeed are the words of, of truth that one is grasped never to be abandoned, the right dharma all surpassing and wondrous. Hear and reflect and let there be no wavering or apprehension. Wow, yeah, that's no. a tall. That's and a it, tall order, man. I <laughs> Easy way now. Yeah, let yeah. me get this straight. <laughs> and you know, I think that because the first thing I thought is like, okay, maybe this is referencing, you know, the the threefold uh, refuges, right? That you know, yeah. hard is it to be born in yeah. human life, and now we're now we're living it difficult it is to hear the, the dharma and now we're hearing it yep but but i don't think that's all that's that can't account for all of what's being said here because um he's talking about uh you know hear and reflect the like of being a wavering or aspiration right so yeah you know clearly there's people who are gonna be who are who are people hearing this dharma, but not necessarily realizing Shinji, right? So that's I think where the the rub, as you put it, yes. is. <laughs> oh, there's the rub. <laughs> and, it, and it is, you know, if you look at the, the the um the passage above, you know, it says he says this way is this teaching is easy to practice. Well, I mean, that's true, right? It is easy to say the name beats me. It's, it's simple and yeah. easy. But realizing true and real Shinji is a whole other matter. We, we know that just simply anyone can say the name beats me um, as something that you, as a verbal that act. But that alone, you know, is not, of course, like as Shinron says, you can have the name that isn't necessarily accompanied by uh, Shinji. So, so that's the the difficult part. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Al although you're pointing out things I wanted to raise too. You you yeah, said yeah, yeah. you know hard to encounter. Okay, we've encountered it though. Mm. So you're not if you. It's right. kind of if yeah. you're reading this. That hurdle is. Passed. If you're reading this, you've encountered it. Um, mm -hmm hard to realize even a myriad kalpas is pure well now obviously that's the part that's yeah the difficult difficulty hard to realize even in the myriad you know kalpas is right. pure shinjin i suppose that's hard you know on the level of just self-power ordinary beings realizing that they can't we can't it has to be yeah it has to be an intervention for us to realize that it's and realized even Amidas, vow. Exactly. Yeah. Vow. Yeah. And I think, too, even the it, the encounter here, and this is something that Kobai Sensei often points out, is, you know, this is not a mere ordinary meeting going on here. This hard to encounter. This encounter yes. is a, is a, um, a coming into, you yes. know, a, a coming into accord with and a being embraced and changed by the the, uh, yes, the dharma. So it's it's a it's a it's a it's, it's a, not merely to it, hear it. So to it's speak. a meaningful it's, event. Uh, it's a exactly. It's a it's a yes. an event that that you know alters your life. Yeah, alters your mind in some way. I'm not saying we're enlightened or you know, but it it it, it affects your heart mind. You yeah, know, it affects it's you. It, it, yeah, there, there's a. You know, it's a moment. It's a strong mm -hmm. moment. And I'll something I while we brought this up, I want to talk mm -hmm. about here at this point of the yeah, encounter. Yeah. Even even a quick encounter, I've realized in recent, very recently, um, mm -hmm. is pretty amazing. And I'll 
tell you that. Should we end this session, though? Should we hold that thought? Uh, yeah. Should we leave the so, cliffhanger? Should I leave okay. that as a cliffhanger? <laughs> sure, yeah? sure. So for the next um, week, because I, I think, yeah. oh boy, am I going to be able to meet next week? Maybe not, actually. Um, the thing is, okay. is I have to go up to Northern California to take my exam. Oh, okay. So probably I'm not going to be able to meet next week, but uh, we could maybe meet the week following. Okay. Um, or it's possible we can meet on this Friday if you are available in the evening. I'll check into it. I'll look. I'll look into it. Yeah. Okay. To see whether that yeah. is a that could be a possibility, though. Yeah. Okay. Since we're yeah. since we've now switched. Right. The, <laughs> it gives yeah, new meaning to you know. It gives new you know. It gives new meaning to uh, you know. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Wherever you are. Whenever you are. Indeed, whichever the perfect. Yeah. 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 So. Yeah. All right. So yeah, shall we go ahead and wrap up for now? And yeah. Then yeah. Unless you wanted the, to. Yeah. Unless you wanted to start a new session and just you know finish this paragraph. Yeah, thing, I would love to yeah. actually. Maybe we should do that because I do have about fifteen minutes. Okay. Um, until Let's I have end, to get going. So. Okay, we'll end this session and we'll start part two in in a minute. Sounds All right? good. All right. Okay. Until then, Namo Mita <laughs> All right. See you in a minute. Namo See ya. See ya. Yeah. Be seeing you. Yes.